Dear students, in this video, we are going to see the definition about Cauchy-Riemann equations. First, there are two conditions. One condition is necessary condition, then the sufficient condition. First condition, the necessary condition for f of z is to be analytic Cauchy Riemann equations first we are going to write the necessary condition this is the necessary condition. The necessary condition is the necessary condition for a complex function f of z is equal to f of z or f of z f of z equal to u of x plus x comma y plus i into v of x comma y simply we write this as f equal to u plus i v this format f of z equal to u of x comma y plus i into v of x comma y to be analytic in a region R then the necessary condition is dou u by dou x equal to tau v by dou y and one more condition dou v by dou x that's equal to minus tau u by dou y that is we simply write the form as this is u x this is v y so u x equal to v y and next side this is vx is uy so vx equal to my negative of uy if you want you can interchange both or minus multiple minus sign on both side then you get that is equal to uy equal to minus vx after multiple minus on both side you get the equation therefore two equations you get it one is ux equal to vy that's one and u y equal to minus v x in case you can use that also v x equal to minus u y anyone here anyone this one one or two any one you can follow either one or two that's the condition of necessary necessary condition for the cauchy riemann equation next is sufficient condition sufficient conditions for f of z to be analytic if the partial derivative ux comma uy comma vx and vy are all continuous in the domain capital D and ux equal to vy 
ui equal to minus vx then the function f of z analytic in a domain d this is the sufficient condition for the cauchy riemann equation we simply call this as c or equations c means cauchy r means riemann equations there are two conditions necessary conditions and sufficient conditions in the necessary conditions we have to prove that these two conditions vx equal to vy uy equal to vx that's the necessary condition in the sufficient condition you are using ux equal to uy uy equal to vx then you have to prove that the function f of z is analytic in a domain d that thing you have to prove that next note in a polar form polar form of c or equations in a polar form so in polar coordinates Z equal to R e power i theta, where R R is the modulus and theta is the argument. In a polar format, you can use the method. This is the form z is equal to r e power i theta. That's the polar format. Next is in Cartesian form. So, in Cartesian coordinates. any point z is z equal to x plus i y here you can assume that z equal to x plus i y this is called the cartesian format here we have four conditions one is the necessary form of the cr equation that is cauchy riemann equation next sufficient condition for the cauchy riemann equation next is the polar form the other one is the cartesian form thank you